Right guys, the quick tour of the garden to show you what I've done so far. Along here, as you can see, I've got some garlic plants. So I put in so far. These are some beetroots that I did grow in the pot, but they came out kind of small, so I decided to regrow them back in the soil. So the beetroots them. I'll show you a closer picture. There's beetroots there. Right. Yeah, I got a celery plant overwintered. It's looking very lovely, very nice. Beautiful green in the organic soil. Alright, this is what the salad bed looks like now. I've given it a little fix up. You can see it's a lot straighter than it was. Alright, let's see what's on there so far from last year. This is basically bare. Some small ch chard plants growing here. Sorry, drop the camera. Small chard plants growing here. Some kale plants, small ones. It's another kale plant. And along here, we'll be putting our salad, our different salad plants, celeries, so on and so forth. Go over to the bigger bed. I've had to cover it with this stuff here because the foxes keep coming along, digging it up. Doesn't help when you're trying to do something. Yeah, but this is pretty much bare, as you can see. I've just got some big chard plants growing over there. We have, have a close up of those. Yeah, these are from a Rambo chard pack I did buy. So that those was the yellow ones. These are the red ones. You can see yeah, these are the red ones there. Right. Basically, under here, we've got the potatoes, which I'm waiting to come up. Once again, I've had to cover them with something because the foxes keep coming and digging them up. We've got the strawberries here. I had to change them from the pot they were in last year into this. I'm hoping hopefully they will do a lot better in this. This I need to regrow, fix it up, put some more onion seeds in there. Spring onion seeds, sorry. But those are from last year basically. There's parsley. It's also from last year. So if it doesn't you know come up green again, then I'll replace that. Here we got some thyme, lovely thyme. I haven't stopped using this all through the year. I've been using this thyme. Another celery. And I also do potatoes in bags. And after I use the bag from um, the compost, I refill them back up, put potatoes in there. And that does well for me. That's, that's basically it. And um, yeah, as it gets better, put more stuff down. Keep you guys in progress. I'll do some more videos. You know, still tidying up slowly. It's a process as I'm going along. And um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video.